channel. Today's video, I'm going to be doing another mukbang. Sorry. Another mukbang. It's going to be with Buffalo Wild Wings. My favorite place to get wings. Other than Wingstop. But they're, they're a little expensive sometimes. So, I can't promise that I'm going to eat all of this. But I always get on their boneless Thursdays. I get the medium right there ah. the honey barbecue Those are the ones that I usually get. This video, I might be smacking my like that. I'm also gonna be drinking a Diet Coke because it makes sense, right? You eat a bunch of junk and then you drink with Diet Coke, so it's healthy. And then ice water. Which is probably what I'll be drinking anyway. I just got the Coke to get it. I'm going to move this out of my way. Needle. Maybe I'll just put like two of each on the plate. I'll do three. That's the medium hot one. And I always ask for extra sauce on them. I love the wings that have tons and tons of sauce. And usually they try to skimp you and... Alright. They always try to <clears throat> skimp you. Which I hate with the wings. With the sauce. Like if I wanted naked wings... I would have ordered naked wings. <laughs> These ones are kind of small. But what do you expect when you get them for like 65 cents each, I think? Ah, I should have opened these beforehand because my hands are all in the ass. And over here I have paper towels. Just so y'all think I'm not ratchet. And I'm going to scoop some of this sauce on here because there wasn't a lot. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I had to edit the video. My son, one, he just pushed me because he's trying to take the Coke. There you go. Don't drop it. And don't start spitting it either. Come on. Ooh, look at that. It's not just satisfying. Ew, that looks gross. Okay, sorry. You will have seen that I edited the video for a second. My son now knows how to open the fridge. So when we're not, when I'm not in there. Sorry, I'm gonna do it like this. Ah. And yes, I'm one of those people, usually I cut my boneless chicken and I eat it with a fork. I don't know why, it's just how I am. My, usually like whenever after work, On Thursday nights, a bunch of our co-worker friends would go to B-dubs and just get their wings and <clears throat> they always make fun of me because they're like, why are you eating it with a fork?
And I just don't like being messy. I try not to be messy. Especially in public. I try not to be messy. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's me, but lately, everything that I've eaten that has to do with chicken, this is a funny taste to me. Don't get me wrong, it's good. It's really good. I just, it has always, it has a funny taste to me lately. I don't know why. That's why you'll see me drinking water. It's because it's like a weird taste. <clears throat> Let me know in the comments below when you go to B-dubs, what is your favorite sauce to, to have on your wings? Before I had my son, like before I got pregnant, I used to uh, eat the the blazon, which was my favorite. I could eat that shit like like nobody's business. I loved it. I would literally take my spoon and eat the sauce. That's literally what I would do. And then they changed it like right after I had my son. They changed the, it was like new and improved and it was like hotter than ever. Hi baby. It was new and improved and like hotter than the one before. And then I got and then I tried it and it, it was hotter. It was hotter but it wasn't too hot for me, but it had a weird taste. Like I didn't like the taste of it. The taste was nasty. I have to like the taste. And then my friends would always be like, oh, do the blazing challenge, do the blazing challenge. I can't eat um, wings with bones. I don't like it. And you can't, there's not a boneless blazing challenge. And if there was, I would I would have done it like every single time I went. But now my new favorite flavor is the Asian Zing. And I never used to get different flavors. Like whenever I would go, I would always get blazing, or I would get like hot barbecue. And then the one time where I went with my friend from work, he got Asian Zing, and I got Blazin, and it was when the Blazin changed. So when I ate mine, I was like, oh, I don't like the taste of these. He was nice enough to be like, oh, you wanna try one of mine? And I remember I looked, I was like, oh, what is that? And he goes, Asian Zing. And I had made up my mind that I wasn't gonna like it, and I was like, I'll try one, but it's probably going to taste like shit. And I tasted one. I felt so bad because I was like, I ate like half of his, I ate like half of his wings. And we were there with like three other people. And they were like, God, Ashley, you ate all his food. And I was like, well, he shouldn't have offered it. One thing that guys should know, if you offer a girl to share your food, that is basically her food. Sorry. Every time I do these videos over here in the dining room, I get distracted because my son is running around and usually bad habit that he has is if he has soda or like any type of drink, he'll spit it on the floor and giggle. Hey, baby. I don't know if you guys like these mukbangs or not, but <clears throat> I figured if I love filming videos and I know I don't post as much as I want to, but I figure if I, I eat a lot and if I could record maybe like, I was thinking that I wouldn't do a lot of mukbangs. 
maybe I did like one a week, like once a week, I did a mukbang. If that would be interesting or something that you guys would like. I'm not sure. I love watching other people. A long time ago. A long time ago. I had like a, a, like a really bad eating disorder. And um, I, I was hospitalized. I was down to like 90 pounds. It was really bad. When I, when I would get hungry... I would just watch other people eat. And as bad as it was, then I wouldn't eat. But after I got better, I continued to watch the mukbangs. And then I would go eat right after the video or during the video I would eat. I have a couple favorite YouTubers that do other videos besides mukbangs that I watch. And, um, Trisha Paytas. I love watching her mukbangs. Even though she's so loud when she eats, it's like one of, it's like one of those things where if I did it, I would be really annoyed with myself. But for some reason, when she does it, it's like an ASMR. ASMR vibe. And I watch, uh, Matt Stoney, who is like my all time favorite YouTuber crush. Whenever I tell people that, they're like, not that they don't think he's cute or anything, but they know the type of guys that I'm attracted to. Usually douchebags. But, um, and I'll never, I go, oh, Matt Stoney. Mm. They're like, really? Mm -hmm. If you're watching this, marry me. Just joking. But yeah, I love him. And I like watching, I think, Nathan Figueroa. He does a lot of, like, challenge-ish videos with food. Him and his girlfriend, who, by the way, they are so adorable. I just got so sad because I watched one of their latest videos, and they're not going to be with each other for a while. Sorry. He's over here making noise. See, this is my life. I got one over here making a racket, and then I got one over... Excuse me. And then I got one over here... Who was just literally baby. Get down. I'm gonna try to eat all of this since then it'll be like a full mukbang where I'm actually eating because I record. Funny story. I have recorded like a lot of mukbangs before. I use so much ranch, it's so unhealthy. Don't let me know that. I already know. Um, I've filmed a lot of mukbangs, I just never have uploaded them. Do you like this setup or would you prefer me to eat in my room? Which I don't mind doing because like I said, the majority of my day when he's home is I'm in that room. And then when he goes to work, this is not, you know, I'm here. But if you like the setup better, I kind of like the setup because I feel like the lighting's better and I feel like you can see me more. And out here it's kind of like, I don't know, hard to explain. Out here it's a little different. And out here you get to see my true beauty. Because at least in the bedroom I have all my, like my ring light and my actual fancy lighting that makes me look prettier than what I really am. I had, um... Somebody, one of my friends was like, oh my god, 
Facebook friends who doesn't know me personally, which is, oh my god, you're so beautiful. And I was just like, thank you so much. But in person, like you can see here, I, I look a lot different. Like, and I'm not ashamed to say it. I, I'm, I'm proud of how I look. Not proud, but I'm aware of how I look. And how it's... I don't know. Hard to explain. I'll just stop because I don't want to annoy people with my insecurity. But B-dubs is probably my favorite food. I haven't eaten there in forever. He could pick the worst annoying, the most annoying noise to interfere with my mukbang. Oh shit. Yeah, shit. You want a bite? He probably won't. like his mama. I, I, ha I have so many foods I won't eat. But I think I'm kind of done because now I'm trying, almost starting to get like ugh, feeling. But I ate a lot. I feel like I ate what, did I have three of each wing or four of each wing? If I have four, that's really fat. So I had my seven wings. My seven wings. That's a lot. But I'm going to cut this video now. I appreciate you guys watching it. If you want to see more of the videos, more mukbangs like this, please let me know in the comments below. And I will see you soon. Don't forget to like, subscribe to my channel. Turn on your bell notifications so anytime I post a video, you will be notified. Thank you for watching. Bye.